set for quarterfinal number two. It's a 4-5 matchup. Ryan Howard, the two-time SEC Player of the Year, set to take on the co-defensive player of the year in the SEC. Q Morrison, the Georgia Lady Bulldogs, the number four seed, taking on Kentucky, the number five seed. Had to figure out how to get themselves going, how to get that flow, and Florida came out just rolling. And Stady with the turnaround jump shot. For Kentucky, Dre Edwards into the game. Here she is with it across half court. And now Howard. To Edwards on the roll to the basket for the first two for Kentucky. And Even with limited attendance allowed here for the SEC tournament, there's Q Morrison knocking it away from Ryan Howard. The co-defensive player of the year turns defense into offense. Oh, team. Georgia playing with so much more energy. And now, granted, they did not play yesterday as Kentucky did, but. Stating the big, running the lane, and a timeout called by Kentucky. Finally picks up her first personal. Howard gets to the basket for her first two. Actually, after what she did last night in yesterday's game, that you're hoping that she can come out and bring that same energy. Howard starts to heat up, knocking down the three. Attack the basket, right? You see multiple players down low, especially on the offensive end. And defensively, they box people out. Kentucky does not. Treasure Hunt stepped in and knocked down the three. Morrison. Defended by Patterson. Coombs tries to go over the top to Caldwell. The little double pump, and Maya Caldwell is just in his own run. Barker with the block. No reset of the shot clock, it's down to six. Wide open look for Treasure Hunt. Shot, this is what gonna, they're gonna, Kentucky is going to have to have other players step up, but that's one of the things that they have said, they've had a balanced team. And when you're going against Georgia. So Hunt, the first one with more than one foul for either team. Caldwell. Well, no doubt about it right now. Maya Caldwell. 59th meeting all time between Kentucky and Georgia. Kentucky with 37 wins in the series. They've won the last three, but it's all Georgia at the moment. Michaela Coombs off the bench. It's in defense. They set up their press, but there's nobody on the backside. So anytime the ball goes over, there's nobody protecting the basket down low. One of the keys is to get the ball down low to Jenna Stady. Morrison uses the Stady screen and gets the roll. Well, I think the biggest thing is just be aggressive. Have a yeah. sense of urgency. When you come out here, you are not guaranteed to win this game just by stepping on the floor. And Chastity Patterson able to knock down that three. You and I don't know about you, but when I see my post players go down and do that, it's a hustle play by Stady, the score by Stady, and that puts her over 1,000 points for her Georgia career. With four and a half to go here in the third. And Howard gambles to pick the pocket of Q Morrison, runs it into Morrison, and Q hanging in there defensively, and Patterson cleans it up. Caldwell with a handle. Talk about a player who's just brimming with confidence right now. They break through, get it to Stady, easy two for Georgia. She'll shake it until she gets back to the offensive end, and then when she posts up. <laughs> it'll, it'll feel fine by <laughs> then, right? It'll be all right. Our turnaround fadeaway. No, Wyatt spins inside of Stady for two. Offensive glass, excellent defensive player. And a second chance here for Georgia. Caldwell has got the size advantage over Patterson and makes a beautiful move to get two more. Nice little cloud. That is the worst thing you can do, especially when you know the defense is coming behind you. Morrison for three. Howard rattles home two more. Can score whenever she wants to, but. Beautiful job like by this, Georgia to you, break the pressure. You got to stay in the flow of the offense. That pushes it back to 16. Howard gets the roll one more time, right? Lucky. Wildcats aren't done yet, especially if Howard can score here on this trip. Howard changes the shot and finishes. Building or <laughs> it's 
Okay, so it's going to be it's going to be 33 for Howard. It was a three pointer earlier, but they may have to clear things up. Final minute, Caldwell clears it up, and the clock will wind down. Coombs will get it across half court, and that will do it. The Georgia Lady Bulldogs have won six of their last seven, and they are moving on to the semifinals of the SEC Women's Basketball Tournament.